Good morning and welcome to your NYSP currency update for Monday, April 29, 2013. As the trading week gets underway, the U.S. currency is trading lower against the euro pound and the yen. Euro dollar is trading at the 131 uh, level, while the dollar yen is right below the 98 level. Meanwhile, the British pound well, against the U.S. currency is trading above the 155 level. In today's uh, trading session, uh, all eyes do remain on the latest developments out from the eurozone, as well as global economic data releases. Uh, first and foremost, the Italian political stalemate did come to an end, and Prime Minister Enrico Letta formed a new government. We also saw Italy's funding costs dropped to its weakest since October of 2010. Also in Greece, the parliament passed a bill to unlock the next two installments of international aid. Here in the U.S. on the data front, personal income as well as spending both rose by 0.2 percent in the latest month. We did see that consumer spending uh, slowed to its uh, slowed and showed the smallest gains since December of 2010. And now taking a closer look at the spot of its market, starting out with the euro-dollar pair. On an intraday basis, the upside prevails. Trading central analysts prefer long positions above 1 and 30.40, with targets coming in at 1 and 31.05 and 1 and 31.30 in extension. That does and moving on to the dollar yen pair on an intraday basis, the 97.20 level is uh, being uh, trading central analysts for short positions below 98.45, with targets coming in at 97.20 and 96.55 in extension. For the euro yen cross on an intraday basis, the downside prevails. It is rebounding but stands below its new resistance and trading central analysts prefer short positions below 128.25, with targets coming in at 126.90 and 126.40 in extension. And that does wrap it up for your currency update for NYFB. Thanks for watching and have a great day.